There you. There you. Coming right at. All right. Yeah, come right in his face. Right there. He it broke. Greg, get that heavy line down here. There he was. Damn. Right there he was. Watch, watch him, Greg. See him making that trail out through there? He just moved about. Yeah, he didn't go far. Hold the pole up. Just kidding. Now, don't pull the hook towards me. Keep him up off the bottom if you can. Just, just lift. He's a good one. Oh. There we go. <laughs> Got one whether we ever get another or not. <laughs> They're one of the oldest creatures on the face of the earth. They've watched the dinosaur come and go, but the turtle has changed very little in its 200 million years of existence. Meet the East Tennessee snapping turtle, an animal whose title is well deserved. Anything that moves in front of that head, they're going to eat it. You know, whether it's a duck or a fish or plastic worm or whatever it is, they're, they're, they're after that movement. We were fishing up on the Emory River uh, one night, and I was just small then, and I caught a catfish, weighed about four pounds, and I was real proud of that. You know? And there was a turtle, just a humongous turtle, and it reached up and one, with one bite took half of my four pound catfish. They can bite you, I'd say, at least two hours after they're dead, with the head chopped completely off. They're tough. In a mean disposition. Old timers, you know, they tell us that, uh, uh, that if it won't ever gets a hold of you, he don't turn loose till it thunders. I saw my dad get bit one time. <laughs> uh, dad was hollering for him to get uh, pry his mouth open, get his finger out. My cousin ran up and started going. Phew trying to make it think it was thundering. I guess he thought that'd make it turn loose. Which one of y'all can cook that thing? He can. Yeah, I, I can cook at it. Sure He's can. the cook. If uh, he cooks it, would you eat it? Why, sure. If I cook it, you'll eat it. <laughs> oh, I will, huh? <laughs> right. Well, let's try to cook that thing up and see what it tastes like. All right, let's go cook some turtle. You gonna grab it there, Greg? Now you'll get about four pounds you, of meat. You won't carry? Probably about... Uh, Probably four to five pounds of meat there out of that. He nipped right. my leg out there here. Like ready to go. Yeah, it's looking good. Try one of those, Bill. Watch Thanks. it now. It's live with a bathroom. <laughs> Eating your own catch is an age-old way of living, and it's a perfect way to end a successful day of turtle hunting. This East Tennessee delicacy tastes like a cross between frog legs and chicken, I'm told. It's good. It's a little chewy. I think I'll have another. That's good. 